You've got to love the packaging from Power Shovel and Superheads. Just look at this, this is great. Um, this is the Blackbird Fly. It's a twin lens reflex camera made of plastic that takes 35mm film. It came to me like this while it was packaged with bubble wrap and in a more sturdy box of course. So this is this is one of the Blackbird flies that has an orange face. You can get one that's blue or black. I'm fortunate enough to have used this camera before. Power Shovel sent me a prototype black version and I shot five rolls of film for them and sent them back to Japan, which they developed and they used in some of their promotional material. Also, some of my photos appeared in a Japanese magazine called Snap, accompanying a review of this really quite cool little camera. As you can see, it's relatively small, it's very light, has the twin lenses, that's the viewfinder lens here and this is the taking lens. It's got reasonably simple controls. There's two apertures, sunny and cloudy. The sunny aperture is f11 and the cloudy, the cloudy aperture is f7. There's also two shutter speeds, n which is your normal shutter speed and that's 1 25th of a second and b which is however long you hold down the shutter lever for. There's the, re there's the wind on knob to wind your film on. There's the film counter window. And this is the rewind lever to rewind your film once you've finished it. There's a hot shoe. And that works quite well with flashes because I've used it extensively when I had the prototype camera when they sent it to me the five days I was meant to take photos with were probably the darkest, most overcast days that we'd had that month in Melbourne. Here's the, the viewfinder. There we go. And as you can see, it's a heads down viewfinder. And depending on what mask you've got in your camera, because it actually has different different masking options, you'll uh, frame your photograph according to those different frame lines in there. I'm not sure whether you can see them. Hang on, there we go. So, can you see that? Yeah. Right, enough of that. The, the viewfinder the head stand viewfinder also has a sports finder option so you can just pop this pop this bit down and it locks into place and there you've got your sports finder. If we have a look at the inside of the camera this is where we can change our mask to give us different um, types of exposure on our 35mm film mask that's in here at the moment is 2.4 by 3.6. That mask will give you a portrait aspect image on your negative. But you've also got the square mask which will give you a, what does it say, 2.4 by 2.4 square image on your 35mm negative. And of course you can actually leave the masks out. If you leave the masks out altogether you'll get a um, an image which also includes the sprocket holes of your 35 millimeter film so that's that will allow the exposure to go to right to the edge of the film and show you the sprocket holes. A technique that's uh, used by some toy camera shooters when they load 35 millimeter film into their medium format toy cameras. Blackbird Fly from Superheads and Power Shovel.